Mga bata, pumasok na kayo! Takip silim na!
magandang gabi sa inyo mga bata. Handa na ba kayo sa kwento natin ngayon? Alam nyo, ang magkwekwento sa atin ay si Paolo Ancheta. Siya ay galing sa Area 3 at dumadalo siya sa Olongapo Seventh-day Adventist Church. Siya ay 12 years old at mahilig siyang magbasa. Kaya nga, magaling din siyang magkwento. Handa na ba kayo na makinig kay Paolo Ancheta? Sige, nandito na siya sa kanyang kwentong Attached Felt Around the World. Pakinggan natin siya. Good morning everyone and children. The Boy Who Brought Heaven Near is the title of my story. It all started at church when a little child concentrated his gaze on a swinging bug. Galileo is the name of the child. What is the name of the child? Galileo, that's right. And he loved and he joys experimenting. He timed the lamp swinging with his pulse and discovered he was correct. That swinging in a broad arc required the same amount of time as swinging in a tiny arc. He performed the pendulum experiment as soon as he arrived home. Then he created more pendulums of various lengths and weights and hung them from ceiling beams and tree branches until his family believed he was insane. But he made its point, and it was this that set him on the path to success. He wasn't going to take anyone else's word for it. So he went out to prove himself. His lecturer told him in school that heavier teen would hit the ground first. He disproved it. He convinced his university professor to accompany him to the top of Pisa's iconic leaning tower. Drop a four kilogram and a 500 gram weight at the same time, but hit the ground exactly the same. In 1609, Galileo made his most important discovery. After learning from a Dutch spectacle helper makers that holding two glass lenses 30 centimeters or so apart made objects look larger. Then Galileo chose bigger lenses and combined them to create the first telescope. His invention became well known. Senators and other city leaders climbed to the top of the company. Venice's tallest building, what they witnessed astonished them. In 30 kilometers away, they could see the streets of Padua and people walking around them. The ship, 80 kilometers away, appeared to be little more than 8 kilometers away. After that, Galileo began selling telescopes. People from all throughout Europe bought them. He named the one he developed especially for himself, the old discoverer and it made objects look 33 times closer. Instead of seeing only a few stars like the naked eye can see, he saw tens of thousands of them. The Milky Way was discovered to be a beautiful ring of stars. Suddenly, he knew the universe was something immeasurable, grander, and most wonderful, not merely the Earth, the sun, the moon, and the few pinpoints of light known as stars. Galileo found that Jupiter and three brilliant stars in a line with it were not stars, but rather moons orbiting the planet. Through clouded glasses, he observed the sun as a big ball of fire with numerous black clouds surrounding it which we now call sunspots. His finding was fantastic. Church officials, however, 
do not believe him and have even imprisoned him for false beliefs. But Galileo was correct. As the years and decades passed, larger telescopes were developed, each one demonstrating not only that Galileo's theories were correct, but also revealing that the cosmos is far larger than even he thought. Perhaps your science instructor will explain how it aids astronomers in seeing billions of kilometers into space and how it showed many new sky beauties. We recall Galileo seeing the swinging lights in the cathedral, inventing the telescopes, unlocking the secrets of God's wondrous world and bringing paradise closer to earth. Thank you for listening. Tama mga bata, kailangan tayo ay laging handa sa ating pagsasalita, sa ating paggawa, sa isang mabait na paggawa natin, sa isang matamis na ngiti, sa isang maliit na babasahin na ibibigay natin sa iba. Ito ay magiging pagpapala at hindi nila ito makakalimutan. Kaya nga, lagi tayong maging mabait at patuloy na tayo ay tumulong sa ating kapwa. 
tayo ay manalangin. Ama naming banal, Diyos na nasa mga langit ka, sa gabi pong ito, akin pong itinatalag ka ang mga bata na ito. Sana po, sila ay patuloy na gumawa ng mabuti sapagkat kayo ang nagbibigay ng kalakasan sa kanila upang sila ay maging mababait na mga bata. Ang amin pong hiling, Panginoon, kay na wapo ang siyang sumama sa kanila sa gabing ito at patuloy sa kanilang buhay lumaki na merong pagmamahal sa inyo. Maraming salamat sa pagdinig sa aming dalangin sa pangalan ni Jesus. Amen. Amen. O siya, paano? Sa susunod ulit, tayo ay magkikita-kita dito sa Takip Silim. Bye!